Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So I've got an unboxing today and yeah, this is a completely new to me company. Completely new purchase from a, a new place, never purchased uh, via it before. And it's from TikTok, would you believe? I like watching all my funnies and everything on TikTok and uh, hubby is absolutely addicted to it but uh, yeah i've noticed there's a few diamond painters on there now um and i noticed one lady just doing a mystery box unboxing uh personally i prefer a longer video so i think i'll stick to youtube for my uh, nice little diamond painting videos and all my little youtube friends hello to everybody and hello if you're new to the channel uh, yeah, so she had this mystery box and I thought, well, I'll go and have a look. You know, when you're surfing late on a night and stuff. And uh, yeah, I thought, right, oh, well, if uh, she's got one, it looked quite interesting. So let me get one and see what we got. Oh, oh, OK. So uh, this is from a place called The Creator's Treasures. I'll try and put a link. Oh, we've got lots of nice... Um, shredded paper that's good like that like that looks really good uh, it says thank you for your order my small business on here we've just got a lovely shiny label there now i ordered this on the 19th of january and it has arrived today which is the 28th of january so it's taken a little bit to come, but to be fair, I think every, the delivery company had this either two or three days ago. I got a notification to say that they'd picked it up. So some of that delay is uh, from the delivery company as well, just to be fair to the company I've purchased from. Uh, now, the mystery box is £20 and I thought, mm, yeah, OK. Um, yeah, you know, it's sort of like one of those amounts where you think, well, yeah, £20 quite a bit to lose if it's not very good. Albeit, I had seen the lady unbox it. I'm sorry, I can't remember which creator it was. And I did save it, but now I can't find where I've saved it to. So maybe that'll pop up at some point. Um, I managed to get free shipping um, from a TikTok coupon. I'm not quite sure how that worked out. Shipping is normally £3.09 from this company. And then because it was, I think, my first order from a TikTok company, I got £5.60 off as well. So all in all, this has cost me £14.40, which, hmm, OK. Uh, it's standard shipping. The company, the Creator's Treasure, is based in the West Midlands. So up near you, Sharon. <laughs> OK, so yeah, liking all this crinkle paper. And what have we got inside? Oh, looks like there's an awful lot in here. Right, OK, so we've got pen button wax, which is fine. Standard toolkit. Looks like we've got a diamond paint in there and another diamond painting there okay so two diamond paintings and oh oh my goodness there's loads in here okay so oh now look at that that's a 3d printed funnel oh i like that and look at the color as well it's hot pink oh my goodness she must have known me it's a hot pink funnel oh do you like that as well Lee? I've got Millie in here with me today. Uh, yeah, she's just uh, expressing her uh, like, I think, of this. Just having a bit of a... Oh, oh, oh. It's because I've got a box and she does like to see what's in boxes. I'll let you have the box in a second. Just let me empty it first. So that's really pretty. It's got a slanted funnel there. So that makes it a little bit easier. But that's lovely. I've not seen one of those before. Great for if you're tipping diamonds back into pots and things like that. So I like that. Thank you very much. Okay, uh, we've got, oh, that's nice. Look, a little rainbow key ring and all the drain drills, all the gems are all bagged up nicely. Look, okay, so that's another one. We've got, oh, one of our favourites, our sticky mats. You can never do without a sticky mat. And this one's like a ready pink. Not quite a hot pink, but ooh, not bad, not bad. Okay. Oh, let me just close my scissors up. Look, I don't want to be stabbing myself. Oh, look, we've got one of these nice bookmark key rings. 
which is a feather. We've had one of these before. Uh, we had our giveaway from one day saving with one of these. Oh dear, are you wanting the box? Are you wanting to come up and look? Come on then. <laughs> okay. Uh, I've just had to let Millie up because she's absolutely mad on boxes and I think it's the crinkle paper that she's after. You liking the crinkle paper? Hey, are you liking the crinkle paper? Giving it a good sniff, what does it sniff of? Not all boxes that uh, I get have actually got dog food in them, but we're just having a, a good look. Okay, can I carry on? Can I carry on? What? What's, let's have a look at this then, let's see what this is. So, oh, this is, this is a mystery cover minder. Oh, and look at that box. Sorry about the sniffing. Don't be pushing it off the edge of the desk. Don't be pushing it. But yeah. This is what I have to contend with when I'm diamond painting. I don't think it's food, sweetheart. I don't really. Let's have a look at this. She's having a, a good look. Okay. So let's see. She's trying to stand up now. Are you just going to lay on my desk? I'm not going to be able to unbox these video uh, these diamond paintings if you laid on my desk, am I? <gasps> a mystery cover minder. What have we got? What have we got? Oh, look. Oh, it's like a little pawn chess piece. It's very teeny tiny, but it has got a little magnet on the bottom. So, yeah, that's very nice. That one's in yellow. So we've got our little cover minder there. Oh, and it sticks to me uh, tape measure as well. Do like all this. And then, oh, we've got some stickers. Can never have enough stickers. So I think that's everything. Uh, yeah, and just a nice bit of uh, purple paper in the bottom. And what's this? Oh, what's this? Oh, these are um, these are your little cover sheets. Oh, wow. Oh, this is fantastic. Well, I think uh, for £20, it's really good value. But for £14.40, which is what I paid, it's excellent value. Okay, so we've got little cover papers. How many have we got? One, two, three, four, five cover papers. And I use these all the time as well when I'm doing uh, full coverage diamond paintings. So, yeah. Okay. Wow. Gosh, it must have taken her ages to sit and put all these things into little tiny bags and sort it all out. So can I put you on the floor now, please? She's having a real good sniff round. Aren't you? You need a good brush. I've had to wash her beard this morning because she's been out in the garden playing, digging. She's trying to get to Australia, aren't you? Hey. Oh my goodness. What are you looking at? Can I put you on the floor with this box? Well, I've never done this before. I've done an unboxing with a dog on my knee. Right, put that box on the floor. Do you want to go on the floor with it? Yeah. No, nope, she don't want to go on the floor with it. So we'll carry on and see how far we get. She will get fed up eventually because my knee is not the comfiest place in the world. Not when I'm sat on this chair anyway. So we have... Wow, two diamond paintings to look at. Let's look at the darker one first. I suspect that this is flowers. Do you think this is flowers, Millie? Do you think this is flowers? Can I, uh, oh, just move you off? Somebody came to the door, so my little assistant has now decided to <laughs> leg it down the stairs and go and see him. Right, so let's have a look at this. This is a, a 40 by 30, it says, or 30 by 40, which is my favourite size. But yeah, I must admit, I'm impressed with this. And I don't like getting mysteries. You know when you... Oh, no, it's a 30 by 30. Oh, that's interesting. <laughs> it says it's a 40 by 30. And it's a 30 by 30. But that's okay. We don't mind. And it's roses. Okay, and butterflies. Right. So, yeah, can you tell I'm out of breath? Because I just have to run all the way down the stairs to get the post out the letterbox and give it to Hubby. Because even though I collect it out of the letterbox, he insists on opening it all. <laughs> Oh dear, right, keeps me fit. I'm not quite sure what fit for, but uh, yeah. Okay, so this one needs a really, really good flattener. But yeah, so we've got a, a 30 by 30, which I think we'll find is a 25 by 25. 
uh, ah, but I just think, gosh, the, the lady who's done these, or the gentleman, I think it's a lady, I'm not quite sure. Um, as I say, the creator's treasures uh, has just spent an awful lot of time putting these together. And yeah, I mean, it does take a lot of time. So yeah, we're 25 centimetres, nine and three quarter inches. And I would think it's the same the other way. Oops, sorry about the squeak. And we are 25 centimetres, nine and three quarter inches. So yay. Okay. Uh, I believe the one that I saw on box just had one 30 by 40 painting in it. And I don't remember it having quite so many other bits and pieces as well. So, yeah. Okay, this actually has a 24 different colours. My goodness. 24. Wow. Okay. Uh, it's all numbers and symbols. And the numbers are 1 is 1 and 8 is 8 all the way down. And then we're all capital letters. And we do have DMC codes, so yeah, it's a pretty good little canvas. Um, it is a little bit blurry, I have to say. Don't know whether you can quite see that. That's not the clearest number threes on that black there. Uh, it's not bad. It's not definitely not the worst I've seen, but that's not the clearest drill table I've seen. But that's not the person who's done the mystery box's fault. That's just part of the manufacturing so we have a rose and we have lots of drills wow as I said 24 different colours goodness me they're all in the uh, silver and uh, blue packaging so these are usually reasonable drills and acrylic drills got a peach purple brown uh, like a peachy red and what's that a sort of not really peach well i suppose a deeper peach maybe they do look very different on camera i know sometimes when i say things are hot pink it looks red on camera it's funny when i watch my videos back and i think oh that looks different color anyway that's definitely orange and that's blue and that's very very pale peach and that's like a rust color and a lot of these there's a lot in these bags but we're not going to be using much i suspect the black Background number one. Oh, number one is 154. Uh, oh, but number three is 310. So it is a lot of black. We've got a pale pink. We have a six. Oh, six. No, six, six, six. We have got a very deep red maroon colour. Uh, caramel chocolate colour. Back to food. Uh, some more sort of peaches. So these are peachy oranges. And that one's like a stone colour. And then like a little bit of a cherry type red another caramel chocolate i'm getting hungry now uh, dark gray and another sort of ready yeah they're definitely sort of ready peachy colors these a little tiny bit of red and then we have two huge bags of uh, black which are your three tons so these can't be in order then ah no i'm going the wrong way that's one two three i've started at the wrong end <laughs> and a little bit of lilac and then a very deep burgundy colour. Okay. So what was, do you know, one of my favourite roses? And because my granddad uh, used to grow roses. He was like uh, in the Carnation Society and he grew roses and everything. He was really into his gardening. And uh, my favourite rose, I remember when I was younger, the one I always liked in his garden was called Whiskey Mac. And that was uh, Peach. So if this is going to come out all the peaches, which I think it is, then that's quite funny that I've got in a mystery box a painting that's a peach rose. Oh, there's no bag to put those in, so I'll have to find something to put them in so that I can label them. I can't have them flapping about like that. I don't do flappy bits. <laughs> OK, and then this one looks like a Kyoto. I think this one could be a kawaii type painting a little cute okay all right now this one says 30 by 30 oh it is a 30 by 30 as well oh look at that oh that is sweet oh we've got two tool uh tool kits with this one this one's got a few little grip seal bags and two lots of wax we must be expecting to uh, share this one with a friend <laughs> Okay, so the drills are in the same packaging, the grey and white packaging. 
Sam, I've no idea where these have come from. Um, possibly one of the budget companies, even uh, Amazon do ones similar to this. Okay, so we did a little flatten. And it looks like it could be, I don't know, maybe a little Shiba in you dog. It does look like a dog. I think it could be a Shiba in you dog. It's got oh, a little nose. Oh, I'm making a right pig's ear of this. <laughs> Give this a flat. Definitely got well and truly folded up these, but that's okay. So, yeah. Okay. Oh, that's really sweet. And she's got her hands on it. Look, she's going good, you good, you good, you good, you good. <laughs> oh, it's a shame Millie's not here because she could have. Uh, modelled that for us couldn't she <laughs> so oh yeah i think it's definitely the little sheba and new dog we've seen similar things to this before on different pictures and things because there's a little bit of his tail coming round here look but it looks like he's really enjoying having that ear rub <laughs> oh and we've got a star here as well look so it's a star right so it is 17 different um colors uh, all capital letters and we have got DMC codes and this one is an exceptionally clear drill field but it is a lot of the white in the background okay so let's just give this a little bit of a tweak flatten out I believe it will be 25 centimeters but we will just double check to make sure Okay, yep, 25, just, ooh, just slightly under 25, so about nine and three quarter inch square. But yeah, that is really sweet, a quick look at these drills. So actually the background uh, is 3865 and L is 819. So we have got a contrasting colours between the arms. I was a little bit concerned that the background was going to be the same colours as the arms and the like little muzzle and the little chest on the dog but no we've got different colours there so it will contrast that's good don't want it to be too white nice little quick paintings today I love a good mystery I just like mystery boxes I suppose I just like surprises yeah unless somebody comes up behind me and goes boo and then I don't like that kind of surprise because that makes me jump <laughs> So, oh, these colours are a lot darker than I was expecting. So we've got a, a pretty good contrasting colours. So we've got like a, a rosy, pinky colour, and then like a peach, and an even lighter peach, and another peach, and that's like a stony colour, and some very pale pink. So I'm thinking that's going to be the arms. That one is number six, which yes is eight one nine. So although it's showing on here as white, it is actually this nice sort of pinky colour, a little pale pink. And then we've got a brown colour there, like a tan and a little bit of a beige. And we're back to tan caramel chocolate. Oh, that's a nice rosy pink. Is that going to be the tongue or the cheeks, do we think? Number 10 is... Uh, oh. Number 10, number 10 is 3328 and it's the letter E. Oh, it's just the highlighting on the tongue in the middle there. Oh, that's a lot of drills just for a little bit of a highlight. Got a black there, another burgundy, a very pale colour, sort of just a beige colour. Nice chestnutty brown. Oh, that's going to be the lovely yellow of your little puppy. And then a little bit of brown highlighting like a mocha colour. And then you do three eight six five. So yeah, you like that. Okay, so this was a little bit of a punt, really. This was a little bit of a risk, really, because I've never ordered uh, via TikTok before. Um, I've never ordered because of something I've seen on a TikTok video. I know there can be quite a few scams on there. People have not got what they've expected. But I think I've done really well. Now let me know in the comments what you think. I'll try and link these things. I'm not sure that I can. Because uh, I think 
TikTok and YouTube are probably rivals. So they probably don't like each other very much. So whether it will let me link one to the other, I'm not quite sure. But anyway, we'll see. So yeah, we have two little 30 by 30 diamond paintings, which possibly not my taste, possibly not what I would have ordered. But as things go, they could have been even more not my taste. You know, I'm quite impressed with these. We've got all the nice drills. We've got a lovely feather bookmark to do, which is wonderful. A little rainbow keychain, and who doesn't like a rainbow? There's a song in there somewhere, but I'm not going to sing. We've got our lovely little uh, custom-made funnel, uh, which I've never seen before. I think that's excellent. Uh, so, yeah, quite. I uh, think I'll be using that. Our little mystery cover minder, which has a very, very teeny tiny magnet on it. But it uh, oops, picks it up, no problem. That will work on a smaller painting, I suppose. <laughs> Put it with our rainbow look. It's definitely a good magnet. It's picking up that, so yeah. And our cover papers. And our little mat. And our stickers. My goodness me. And three toolkits. Uh, four toolkits. Wow, okay. Ah. <laughs> uh, so on the whole, I think for £14.40 that I paid, I'm really, really happy. And I just love the way this company's presented all its things. Um, I think it would have been nice if there was maybe a little uh, business card or something that I could have showed you uh, so that you could see, you know, who she is and what she does or what they do. As I say, I'm not quite sure uh, who they are. <laughs> um, you know, oh, we've got, yeah, we've got like a little sticker here look that's got uh, their logo on, which is the Creator's Treasures. So we've got CT Creator's Treasures, but that's very, very small there. So yeah, I, you know, I'm uh, yeah, very impressed. I don't know that I'd ordered an, order another one because obviously I've already had one, but certainly, yeah, yeah, it's been really good fun and I've really enjoyed looking at this. So I hope you've enjoyed looking at this with me. Uh, let us say, let me know in the comments down below what you think have you ever ordered from this company and uh, yeah, do you think it's good value for money <laughs> okay well if you have enjoyed looking at this with me a thumbs up is always very much appreciated so leave your comments in the uh, little comment section down below and i'll get back to you as soon as i can and if you want to subscribe do that by pressing this little button down in this corner very important uh, it's basically like just joining our little family and all it means is that you'll get notifications when my new videos come up so you're not gonna miss anything yay okay thanks ever so much for stopping by and i do hope to see you all again soon bye for now